What's going on everybody? It's Dan the Realtor, your local Montgomery County real estate agent, back again with another video. Today, we're gonna be in Montgomery County, taking a look at this beautiful property in the city of Montgomery Village, Maryland. So, without further ado, let's get into it. Are you interested in knowing what $639,000 gets you here in Montgomery Village? Well, welcome. Uh, so we're gonna be taking a look at a $639,000 house. The house has four beds, two and a half baths. Uh, it's got four beds on the main level and it's got two full baths upstairs and a half bath. Uh, it's also got a wood fireplace um, and a beautiful backyard, wonderful landscaping. Uh, and I'm excited to show you this house. I'm excited to show you this neighborhood. So before we get into the house, make sure that you like, subscribe and share. If you're interested in getting in touch with me directly, click the link below and schedule a Zoom call with me and let's get online and talk about your home need. I'm really a fan of this house. I think it's beautiful. Um, the landscaping, like I said, is just is just amazing. Uh, it's got a nice, beautiful garage. This could, this could be it. This could be yours. So without further ado, let's get inside and take a look at the property. Okay, so let's take a look inside and see what we got. First of all, what I really like about this house is this is a, what we call a colonial structure here. Um, and their yard work is fantastic. Now, here's one thing I will say about neighborhoods. You want neighborhoods with big trees. And the reason you want neighborhoods with big trees is because, you know, it's an older neighborhood and they take really good care of their trees. These are the types of trees you want to see where the branches, see how they have maintained it. That's something you really want to consider. I really like that. Well, let's take a look on the inside. So we've got four beds, two and a half baths. And uh, I love immediately how clean and nice this is. Very traditional uh, structure here. So let's take a look into this great room this is nice you got your vaulted ceilings that's beautiful this is like nice little chill area you can entertain and not have to really worry about people going up in the main space of the house it's just like a nice little relaxing area and here we have what looks like to be an office space here. And it looks like they just got it set up kind of as extra workspace. But this almost looks to me more like it could operate as a formal dining room. And this is your kitchen. And the kitchen it's nice. I like a white kitchen cabinets. Um, you know, it's got some of the original white appliances, but I don't think that's much of a big deal. And what you're going to notice there, I love, love some good wood beams. Kind of makes me, reminds me of Chip and Joanna Gaines. <laughs> okay, we're going to go out to the back in a second, but First, let's check out the bedrooms upstairs. This is a really nice kind of dining room, dining area here. Whip burning fireplace. This is just cool. This is a cool little area here. And it circles all the way back around to the great room again. Let's go, let's check out the upstairs. So we've got four bedrooms up here. Now we've got two full bathrooms on this floor. The first bathroom here. Pretty nice. And this house, if I didn't mention it, <laughs> and this house is, uh, so this is what, $639,000 gets you in Montgomery Village. Just walked up those stairs. 
Now, these look like the original hardwood floors. It's a cute first bedroom here. Let's check out the next bedroom down the hallway. This house is spacious too, by the way. We are at 2,700 square feet, but I think that's just 2,700 square feet above ground. I honestly don't think that that's including the basement. I could be wrong. So we enter into the master bedroom here. This looks like you could definitely fit a king size bed into this one if you were so inclined. Now this master bedroom has another little area here for your sink. You've got full walk-in closets. Then you've got your master bathroom here. Okay, let's check out the next bedroom. <clears throat> this house is just it's got a lot of space. This is really gonna be for a really, you know, a young family or maybe even an older couple that's just looking for more space, you know? But I just really see a bunch of families, a nice family living in here, creating some memories. And this is the fourth bedroom. Four bedrooms upstairs. They all have these beautiful ceiling fans and the you know the floors could use a little bit of work I ain't gonna hold you but for 639 it was a good deal let's check out downstairs got your washer and dry the bones of the house in there your hvac system and then you've got a, another, I call this about another maybe six or 700 square feet down here. About the size of my first apartment. <laughs> All right. Let's check out the backyard. All right. And you'll notice the landscaping out here is very beautiful. It's always good when, you know, homeowners take care of their yards. You have a nice little entertaining space here very peaceful Whew. tripped up and a little gazebo out there or a little patio rather Yeah, puppy. Yeah, puppy. There's a beautiful patio. All right. Okay, so let's talk a little bit of numbers for a property like this one. 639,000, what exactly does that get you? 
So on a conventional loan with an average of about 5% down with a 6.8% interest rate and a 30 year fixed loan, your down payment is going to be around $31,000 and your mortgage is going to end up being somewhere around $5,176. Again, this is just an estimate. That $5,176 include $3,993 for P&I, $352 a month for taxes, $362 for a monthly insurance, PMI of $329. Now remember that falls off once you get to 80-20 loan to value ratio. That's only assuming if you only put 5% down. Your HOA fee is gonna be about $138 a month. You're gonna put about $31,995 down. Your prepaids are gonna be about $8,203, which brings you to around $63,000 in total closing costs. Now that includes your down payment and your closing costs. So what'd you think? Could you see yourself living in this house? If you could, feel free to give me a call, 301-806-3179, or click the link below and schedule a Zoom call with me and we can get you inside. In the meantime, make sure to like, subscribe, and share, and hit that notifications button so you're the first person to know when I drop new content. I'm Dan the Realtor, your local Montgomery County real estate agent. I'll see you next time.